Ooh, a camera lens. Oh, I can play with it all day, all night. I cannot do it because I have a cut in my hand. I always clap in the beginning of my video, and then I have this... Okay, I'm looking for an intro, and I don't know how to start this video. Oh, here's a good one. Good, 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 good morning, Jake Pollers! Huh? What? Jake Pollers? Oh, hell no! Oh, here's another one. Hey, yo, good morning, low gang, what's up? Low gang? Low gang? Yeah, I am from the low gang, but not like this. This is my own YouTube channel, low gang. Stop, stop copying me. What's up guys? How are you guys doing today? Oh shit, this is Lance Stewart's star. I think YouTube is gonna ban me permanently. <laughs> Welcome back, NJ Squad. This video, I want to talk about myself to let you guys know me better. I want to respond some of your questions right in this video. If you're still not subscribed to my channel, make sure to do that right now. Subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you never miss any video. And follow me at Instagram at AndreV11. There's still no notification from your bitch already. I'm not gonna continue this video unless you're gonna follow me. So as I said guys, this video is very important to me and I want you guys to know me better. So I'm gonna tell 10 facts about myself and I'm gonna respond to some of your questions. Let's do it. Let's begin with the 10 facts about me. The first fact is, when I was a little boy, um, since the elementary school, not many people wanted to hang out with me. In fact, Almost none of them hang out with me. I'm not quite sure why. I saw myself as a different person and people just saw me as a problematic person. They did not have any interest and I did not have any connections between them and me. I was just like, you know, in the middle of nowhere. I just felt isolated from the system. Second fact, um, when I was 10, I moved to Czech Republic to Prague. I was living there for four years. Third fact, I know five languages. I know Russian, Hebrew, English, Czech and Slovak. Russian is my main language because my parents are from Ukraine. We're talking to Russian when I'm home. English is like my second main language I would say because usually I'm thinking in English all of my systems are in English and I just love this language just because this is the, uh, the international language for fact I have a sister her name is Kate she's 13 years old I'm not showing her much just because uh, she's not into the videos she's she's making musically videos she's not good at English so this is why I'm not putting her fifth fact I volunteer for kids a lot like I literally before I joined the army there was that thing in the school where you had to volunteer volunteer like 60 hours so I was the first one who volunteered for kids sixth fact um, my parents are divorced I'm living with my mom and with my sister seventh fact I'm serving in the military in IDF aka Israel Defense Forces eighth fact my dream job and career is being an actor ninth fact the goal of my life so my goal in life is gonna happen when my first kid is gonna be born I always see my dreams as so my son when he's born, when he's like two years old, but, and, and it's just like, you know, it's so emotional. Ten fact, when I was four months old, I was diagnosed with something like blood cancer, and doctors said that I had like 50-50% to live. Okay guys, these were ten facts about me, um, I hope you learned a little bit about me. Now we can go on with the Q&A. Let's get into it. First question is from my friend Khalil from Dubai, he's the creator of the International Logan Group. Let's hear it out. Yo, what's up, Andrew Squad? Uh, my question is, what was the best moment of your life? Your boy, Kelly. My boy! Best moment of my life? It was when I met my cousins for the first time. I remember that the day, it was my grandmom's birthday, and she wanted to make everyone meet everyone to know each other more. I met three of my cousins, uh, one of them I actually knew him. Of two other ones, I did not even know about their existence. And I remember how the smallest one, he was like five years old, he just came up to me, he was just hugging me and just said, this is so cool, I have a cousin. My older cousin, he was like, uh, yo, I'm so glad we finally met each other. Unfortunately today, we're not keeping in touch that much, we're not even meeting, it's like been almost a year that we did not meet. Uh, I wish it was not like that, I tried to make contact with them, we're, we're only talking on WhatsApp and and that's pretty much it. Second question is from Neelish Kurskri. I don't know how to pronounce this. I'm sorry, but um, let's hear the question. Hi, Andy. My question for you is: uh, What inspires you the most, apart from the social media influencers and the people you look up to? If I got your question right, in social media and overall on the internet, it's easier to find someone with the same interest as yours and it's way easier to talk to him about it and you can just be fully open to a person but you need to rely on that same person because you never met him or her. Next question is from Maur Madmon. 
I think I got this one right. Do you have any pets? If so, how many? So yes, I have two pets. Her name is Jessie. She's almost five years old. She's half Yorkshire and half Pincher. My second pet is this creature. Look at her. I didn't even know how it's called in English. She's really fat. Next question is from Botaka underscore Salevsky underscore two. It's me, Boris. Um, are you gonna slap Morgan for two million dollars? One more time, please. Are you gonna slap Morgan? One more time, please. Are you gonna slap Morgan? <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna do it for free. Just make sure to buy me a ticket to LA, to buy me a ticket back to Israel, and, you know, just give me an access to his house. I'm gonna record it on the video, and I'm gonna be popular, bro. It's gonna be good for everyone. I don't need this two million dollars. I'm gonna do it for free. This person actually wanted me to work a little bit on how I pronounce his username. So it's I, I am Kshitji. I, I am Kshitji. I'm still not good at this. I'm really sorry, bro, but let, let's see your video. Hey, Andy, what do you really feel about Logan Paul fans? Uh, suicide situation happened. Right now, he took a break, and the fans be like, oh, uh, oh, babe, please come back. We can't live without We can't live without your vlogs. Okay, look, my response to this is that people are taking this issue very seriously until today. I must mention that this is his first mistake, and before that, if you look back at his history, he is a big influencer. Because of him, I'm shooting this video right now, like, just because of him. It's not Jesus, he's just a regular person who can make a mistake. Next question is from Cheyenne.con4. I just want to say, well, what's your favorite car? And yeah, bye, peace. Every time that I watch his uh, Instagram stories or videos, I'm always looking back at my age and I'm saying like, yo, I was similar, but he is better. He might be, when he will hit my age, he might be a big YouTuber. So let me respond to your question. My favorite car that I really wished I could afford is Audi RS7. Uh, you don't see these cars in Israel that much. The second car that I love the most is Tesla. I like it because of the design, because of the idea. I saw their concept for 2020 Model S, I think, which hits 100 km kilometers per hour or 60 miles per hour and within uh, 1.9 seconds, which is insane. Next question is from my friend Mahmoud Kilani7. Uh, he actually opened his new Instagram account, which is just Kilani7. So make sure to follow him there. Bandit Squad, my question for Andy. You ghost, bro? Oh, wait, uh, I was not paying attention to the question. Let me listen to it once again. Bandit Squad, my question for Andy is if they made you choose or pick a city that you will live in for the rest of your life, what city would it be and what is your dream job? Well, um, I think that the city that I would love to live in forever is Fortnite just because you can do whatever the f*** you want and you can build, you can distract, you can do everything. But for real though, the city that I would love to live in is uh, Los Angeles, California or Toronto, Canada. Hey Andy, what's up? <laughs> okay, my question for you is, are you crushing on someone right now? Well, if you do, describe her. I can tell that um the cutest person on Instagram and I can describe myself as the best. You cannot judge me because this is literally what I think. Actually, I don't even know. This is this is really tough, but I think you're cute. A question from Tyler Dwyer 7. Do fish only get hungry? This way? This way? Okay guys, this is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned a little bit more about me. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and click the bell icon so you'll never miss a new video. If you have any video ideas, make sure to DM me them on my Instagram at andreev11. So now there's a question for you. Do you want me to make a gaming YouTube channel? For now guys, thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. Peace.